Luke Lango is out with a stock teaser that has the investing world buzzing and claims to know seven stocks that are the best stocks to cash in on for AI. This is in his 2023 Tech Melt presentation. Luke is using the acronym SUPRMAN to promote the teaser. Each one of the stocks he's recommending starts with one of those letters, and he claims these stocks will dominate the coming $15 trillion AI sector. Well, I have good news. I was able to figure out all the stocks in the presentation and will be revealing them in this video. Additionally, I'll tell you how each company is connected to AI so you can determine if they're right for you. Let's get started now. First we'll start with the letter S, which is Symbotic. Symbotic is a company that provides AI-enabled robotics automation technology for the supply chain industry. It has developed a revolutionary end-to-end -end system that uses intelligent software to orchestrate advanced robots in a high-density warehouse environment. Symbotic claims that its technology can increase efficiency, speed and flexibility for its customers, which include some of the world's largest retail, wholesale, and food and beverage brands. Symbotic is connected to AI in several ways. First, it uses AI to power its robotic vision and sensing capabilities, which enable the robots to identify, pick and place items accurately and quickly. Second, it uses AI to optimize its robotic palletization algorithms, which create outbound pallets that are stable and space efficient. Third, it uses AI to self-learn and adapt to changing conditions in the warehouse, such as inventory levels, demand patterns and customer preferences. Symbotic recently became a publicly traded company through a business combination with SVF Investment Corp. 3, a special purpose acquisition company sponsored by an affiliate of SoftBank Investment Advisors. The transaction delivered significant growth capital to Symbotic, which plans to accelerate its expansion and execute an industry leading $11 plus billion in contracted orders. Next we have Unity Software, which is the U. Unity Software is a company that provides a platform for creating and operating real-time 3D, RT3D, content. It offers tools and services that help creators develop games, simulations, animations, and other interactive experiences for various platforms and devices. Unity Software is connected to AI in several ways. First, it offers a machine learning agent's toolkit, ML Agents, which is an open source project that enables games and simulations to serve as environments for training intelligent agents. ML Agents allows creators to use reinforcement learning, imitation learning, neuroevolution, and other machine learning methods to make their characters and environments more realistic, engaging, and adaptive. Second, it is developing an AI beta program, which aims to provide AI powered game development tools to millions of creators. The program will leverage generative AI techniques, such as natural language processing and computer vision, to help creators produce and optimize content faster and easier. For example, creators will be able to use natural language commands to generate code, animations, effects, or assets. Third, it has partnered with OpenAI, a research organization dedicated to creating artificial general intelligence, AGI, to explore how Unity can be used as a platform for AGI research and development squared. Unity and OpenAI have collaborated on several projects, such as GPT-3 Playground, which allows users to interact with GPT-3 models using Unity's user interface squared. Next we have the letter P, which is Palantir Tech. Palantir Tech is a company that specializes in big data analytics. It builds software that helps organizations to integrate their data, decisions, and operations. It has three main products, Palantir Gotham, Palantir Foundry, and Palantir Apollo. Palantir Gotham is used by counterterrorism analysts and other government agencies to find patterns and connections in large and complex datasets. Palantir Foundry is used by corporate clients to manage and analyze their data and improve their business outcomes. Palantir Apollo is the operating system that powers both Gotham and Foundry across different environments. Palantir Tech has a lot to do with AI because it uses machine learning and artificial intelligence techniques to process and analyze data, as well as to generate insights and recommendations for its users. Palantir Tech also claims to be a leader in AI, ML platforms according to an independent research firm. However, Palantir Tech also acknowledges that computers alone cannot defeat an adaptive adversary, and that human judgment and creativity are essential for solving complex problems. Therefore, Palantir Tech's software is designed to augment human intelligence, not replace it. Before I reveal the rest of the stock I want to quickly talk about my favorite investing newsletter, which is the Insider Newsletter. I've reviewed over 100 stock picking services, and Insider Newsletter performs the best and actually beats the market. The best part is it's only $1 to try. There's a link under this video that will take you to the Insider Newsletter. After you're done watching this video, click on it and check it out. Next we have R, which stands for Recursion Pharmaceuticals. Recursion Pharmaceuticals is a digital biology company that is developing a drug discovery platform and pipeline with machine learning. It uses automation, high-throughput screening, computer vision, 
and artificial intelligence to analyze large-scale biological datasets and identify novel compounds for various diseases. It has one of the largest, broadest and deepest pipelines of any technology-enabled drug discovery company, with programs targeting rare diseases, oncology, neuroscience, information and immunology. Recursion Pharmaceuticals has a lot to do with AI because it uses AI techniques such as deep learning, generative models, and reinforcement learning to process and analyze images of cells, tissues, and organs, as well as to generate new molecules and optimize their properties. Recursion Pharmaceuticals also claims to be creating virtuous cycles of learning around datasets to build a next-generation biopharmaceutical company. However, Recursion Pharmaceuticals also acknowledges that AI alone cannot solve the complex challenges of biology, and that human expertise and collaboration are essential for advancing science and medicine. Therefore, Recursion Pharmaceuticals platform is designed to augment human intelligence, not replace it. Next we have, M, which stands for Mobile AI Global. Mobile AI Global is a company that develops autonomous driving technologies and advanced driver assistance systems, ADAS. It produces cameras, computer chips and software that enable vehicles to detect and avoid obstacles, navigate traffic, and perform other functions. It has a product called Supervision, which is a technology platform that provides automated assistance and navigation functions for drivers. It also has a product called Mobile AA Drive, which is a self-driving system that can operate in various environments and conditions. Mobile AA Global has a lot to do with AI because it uses AI techniques such as computer vision, deep learning, and reinforcement learning to process and analyze images from cameras and sensors, as well as to generate driving policies and actions for vehicles. Mobile AA Global also claims to be leading the evolution from assisted to autonomous driving with its innovative solutions. However, Mobile AA Global also acknowledges that AI alone cannot ensure the safety and scalability of autonomous driving, and that human oversight and collaboration are essential for advancing the technology and the industry. Therefore, Mobile AA Global's products are designed to augment human intelligence, not replace it. Next we have, A, which stands for Appian Corp. Appian Corp is a company that provides a low-code automation platform for building enterprise software applications cubed. It helps organizations to unify their data, decisions, and operations in end-to-end -end processes. It has four main products, Appian Data Fabric, Appian Process Automation, Appian Total Experience, and Asterisk Appian Process Mining. Appian Data Fabric enables users to access and integrate data across systems. Appian Process Automation enables users to design, automate, and optimize their business processes. Appian Total Experience enables users to create engaging and personalized user interfaces. Appian Process Mining enables users to discover, monitor, and improve their processes based on data. Appian Corp has a lot to do with AI because it uses AI techniques such as machine learning, natural language processing, and computer vision to enhance its platform and products. Appian Corp also claims to be a leader in software for digital process automation, which leverages AI to automate complex and dynamic processes. However, Appian Corp also acknowledges that AI alone cannot solve the challenges of business transformation, and that human creativity and collaboration are essential for delivering value and innovation. Therefore, Appian Corp's platform is designed to augment human intelligence, not replace it. And finally we have, N, which stands for Nice Limited. Nice Limited is a company that provides customer experience software for various industries, such as financial services, healthcare, retail, and telecommunications. It helps organizations to improve customer loyalty, reduce cost of service, increase sales, and achieve compliance. It has four main product categories, conversational AI and chatbots, workforce engagement, CX analytics, and automation. Conversational AI and chatbots enable users to create and deploy intelligent virtual assistants and chatbots across different channels. Workforce engagement enable users to manage and optimize their workforce performance, quality, and training. CX analytics enable users to analyze and improve their customer interactions and feedback. Automation enable users to automate their business processes and tasks with robotic process automation, RPA, and voice authentication. Nice Limited has a lot to do with AI because it uses AI techniques such as machine learning, natural language processing, computer vision, and voice biometrics to enhance its software and solutions. Nice Limited also claims to be a leader in software for digital process automation, which leverages AI to automate complex and dynamic processes. However, Nice Limited also acknowledges that AI alone cannot deliver exceptional customer experiences, and that human empathy and collaboration are essential for creating value and satisfaction. Therefore, Nice Limited software is designed to augment human intelligence, not replace it. Once again, my favorite place to get stock picks is inside a newsletter. You can try this market-beating newsletter for just $1 for 30 days and then it's only $35 per month after. Click the link under this video to check it out.